but we have an additional gift for you. We have a person who has traveled over 3,000 miles on this rainy day from sunny California to be here with each and one of you to celebrate your graduation at his university. I will now ask the chairman of the board of Arcadia University to step forward. Thank you. It is my distinct pleasure to introduce to you the next president of Arcadia University, Carl Toby Oxholm, who has traveled those 3,000 miles. Toby is Senior Vice President of Drexel University and Dean of its Center for Graduate Studies in Sacramento. He has served as Drexel's Executive Vice President and Secretary to its Board of Trustees and is, as a member of the uh, Drexel's Faculty Senate. He has spent the last two years as Drexel's Senior Officer, Campus Founder, Visionary and Spokesperson for the West Coast. Toby is, a, is passionate about higher education and liberal, liberal arts, and he will bring his boundless energy and enthusiasm to Arcadia on July 1st. We are most anxious and pleased to welcome Toby and his wife, Kim, to our family. I want to start off by thanking you sincerely for having a long commencement ceremony tonight. I think I circled Philadelphia four times. I saw the Gray Castle only twice, though. It was a wonderful thing to see from the skies. Yeah, it, it is a pleasure to be here, really, in more ways than one, because I did leave Sacramento, California this morning around 4.30. Um, so it's great to get landed. It's wonderful to be here in front of this class of graduates. It's this is my first graduation here. Thank you for having me. I, I grew, I'm a, I'm a Radnor High boy, okay, so I'm local. Any Radnor High groups? No? Yeah. Ooh, yeah. Um, and I went away to college, met my wife in graduate school. Um, any of you met your significant other here while you're at college, grad school? Only one? The rest of you ought to get your money back. So Kim and I moved back, and we had our first home in Mount Airy where we started raising our kids. So it is a delight. Mount Airy, yeah. It is a delight to be here. It's wonderful to be among graduate students. For the last three years, I've been heading up Drexel's Graduate Center in Sacramento, California. How we got there, I don't know, but it's wonderful to get back here, I've got to tell you. But let me tell you this, graduates of the graduate schools. I know graduate education. I know what it means to be a graduate of a university. I know, and I want you to know, what this means for you. Did you have a good time when you were studying here? Yeah. <laughs> All right, parents, was this a good experience for your sons and daughters or what? Yeah. I'm gonna give you one more chance. Was this a good experience at Arcadia for you? All right, now we have to talk about the Alumni Fund. <laughs> you will be leaving this place when you leave the door, right? You're going to have a party, and then you're going to get out of here. But you're not leaving Arcadia. This is who you are, and we are who you are. And when you go anywhere in the world where you're going to end up doing whatever you're going to do, as well as you're going to do it, thanks in large measure to the faculty who've been educating you here, you will be Arcadia, and we are proud to call you Arcadia. We want you to come back this time next year to find out where we're going to hold this event when it's really sunny. And we want you to remember that it's your time, your talent, and your treasure that is going to make this into the exceptional universal university in the world in terms of study abroad and bringing the richness of that world to here. This has prepared you enormously well for a world that is far more integrated than when I went to grad school in the 70s. Leave here with the confidence that you can face uncertainty, 
lack of definition, newness, change, because it's coming at you every day. And these folks here prepared you for it. And as you do well in your careers, remember who made it possible for you to become who you are. Come back and visit. Mentor an Arcadian student. And yes, give to the Alumni Fund to make sure we have enough money to do this for the next generation of bright, inquisitive, challenging minds like you. I'm so proud to be here. Thank you for having me. Good luck to you.